Hi guys, it's Nikki with Sweet Bee Farms. I hope you're all having a great day. Today I'm going to be mixing up some oxalic acid to do the dribble method um, to put into my hives for mite control and I thought I'd bring you along and show you how I make that mixture and how I put it into the hives. The oxalic acid dribble method, essentially we're gonna take our oxalic acid and mix it with sugar syrup and put that um, directly onto our bees to help control the mite population. This method is effective and it's easy and it doesn't require a lot of extra equipment. So I'm gonna show you how I do that. Now, the things you're gonna to wanna to have with you to do this, you're gonna to wanna to have your oxalic acid. You can get this at a bee supply store or you can just get it at your local hardware store. It's sold as wood bleach. You want to have um, sugar and water, which I'll grab in a second. You wanna use hot water. Now I will put the exact measurements to uh, this method and the quantities down in the comment section below. You want to have a scale so you can measure everything out um, accurately. Some containers for mixing a wooden or plastic utensil to stir with. You want a syringe to be able to um, dribble the oxalic acid syrup onto the bees. And you want to have protective equipment. So whenever we're mixing this and we're working with it, we always want to have on gloves, um, eye protection, and respiratory protection. You can use something like this or you can use an N95 mask, but it's important that you have that on. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go grab my hot water, put my protective equipment on, and we're gonna mix this up. Okay, I've got my hot water here ready, and what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to measure out my oxalic acid. And now it's important, whatever containers that you use to mix these, that you label them and keep them um, just for use for this method. Um, so you don't want these to go back into anything that you would put food into. Once I have my oxalic acid measured out, I'm going to put that into uh, my water, which is pre-measured, and this is hot water. Be careful not to splash this. And we want to stir this to get our oxalic acid dissolved. Um, you wanna stir it, but not splash it. And once you see that that's completely dissolved, we're gonna add in our sugar to our hot water. I'm making a little bit of a mess, which is why I like to do this outside. We're gonna continue stirring this until all of our sugar is dissolved. Now once our sugar is dissolved, we're going to let this mixture cool down to room temperature and then it will be ready for us to um, put into our hives and I will check back in with you guys when it's time to do that. Okay, so to um, install the oxalic acid, we're going to use the dribble method, like I said. So we're gonna take our syringe and our pre-mixed um, sugar syrup with the oxalic acid. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna dribble five milliliters between each frame of the hive directly onto the bees. I would suggest that you try this um, prior to putting it in the hive because you kind of there's a kind of a method to squirting it and it can get a little aggressive if you're not used to it. So this is a 5 ml syringe. So essentially I'm going to dribble one syringe down each area of the frames directly onto our bees.
You don't want to use any more than 50 mLs per hive. And this is not harmful to the bees. The bees will clean this off of each other. So if you have frames that do not have bees between them, I would not um, put your oxalic acid dribble in there because you want this to go directly onto the bees and not onto the frames and hive itself. And that's how it's done guys. Um, if you have any questions, leave a comment down below. Have a great day.